Community Life Magazine Entertainment section. We're here with Stephanie Hayes. And you want to tell me a little bit about what you guys are doing here? Sure. I'm the marketing manager here for V Entertainment. I also do marketing here with Jennifer Gladwell, our mall manager here at Via Port Florida. Uh, we have a lot going on here. Um, we've since the owners have taken over the property, we have gotten a lot of um, new things coming into the property as far as to bring in families and we have a lot of different programs that we're offering and they're free of charge to people. So this way they can come, they can bring their families, they can they don't have to worry about the cost. We offer a, vari a vast variety of we have Zumba classes for adults. Um, we have women's self-defense classes. Um, we have Toddler Tuesday for the kids. We have uh, basically our Toddler Tuesdays and our every Tuesday. And there they can come in, they do arts and crafts, they have face painting, totally free of charge. Um, after they're done, they can go play in the kids zone and the parents can kind of, mothers can sit and chit chat amongst other mothers. Uh, we also have on our women's self-defense class that we offer, it is the third Monday of every month. Um, my husband actually teaches that class. And so he, I gather you know a little bit about self-defense. Yes, sir. <laughs> and you're not one that's just going to scream. No, no, okay. and he's made sure of that. Sometimes he says too much. So basically I have, um, he does that on the third Monday of every month, mm -hmm. and it's from 6.30 to 7.30. Um, we do have class spaces limited, so it goes up about 25 students that we take, okay. so they have to pre-register. Um, we have yoga on Wednesdays and Fridays. Um, and everything that we host now as far as our fitness classes are held down here at the East Wing as far as down by okay. um, the Lake Nails Bond, or Lake, mm -hmm. Lake Nails um, across from Regis. Um, as far as, of course, we have the VFS coming up this Saturday. Uh, 2016 from 10 to 9 over here at V Entertainment in the parking so lot. So where would they go find out any other events that you have? Um... All of our events are always going to be on our Facebook page and our home pages. Um, we have a couple of them. We have our Via Port Florida. Mm -hmm. uh, that's our Facebook page for Via Port itself. Um, Via Port actually owns Via Entertainment. It's just a separate entity. Okay. Um, we have a Facebook page for Via Entertainment, which is Via or viaentertainment.com okay. and so um, that's for our Facebook page. The website though for people to be able to book parties and to check out what's going on at Via Entertainment is www.viaentertain.com um, okay. and then we also have a home page for Viaport and there you can see all of our events which our next one coming up is Easter Bunny so he'll Easter be Bunny, arriving. that's the name of it? That's our, you know, the Easter Bunny will be arriving. We're having a bunny brunch. And what does that consist of? That is a free breakfast to kids of all ages. Mm -hmm. um, they can come, they can color, we're going to do little games. They have a full breakfast for the kids, totally free of charge. They just call in, they register, their parents can register, we have a list going. Um, the Bunny Rabbit, that'll be on Saturday, I believe it is the 19th, because the Bunny Rabbit arrives on the 17th for pictures and stuff, mm -hmm. but our Bunny Brunch will be on the 19th. So. Okay, and that's for any kids. Any kids. What age to what age? Because there's a um, lot of people. That there's a lot of kids. kids. Yeah, um, we try to stop it around 14 years okay. of age. Um, and kind of tend it towards the younger, you know. Um, and but it's a nice. We host it every year, and it's that we do the same thing with Christmas. We have our, you know, um, Santa Claus comes, and we do a breakfast with Santa Claus. We do pet photos of Santa Claus. So, and they're always, you know. So let me ask you this: What made you choose to get into this right? To be honest, um, when yes, I, I yeah, to be honest, honest, honest thing, um, when I came to Viaport, um, actually back then it wasn't Viaport, it was Lake Square Mall, and so I started out in guest services, mm -hmm. and back then we used to sell gift cards out in the mall, and so I started out there, got trained, within six months I got promoted, and I they decided to bring guest services here in the office. At the time, we had a different marketing director, and I kind of started doing home shows with her, um, breast cancer shows, mom's night outs, and really got into it. And so I started doing assistant marketing at that time. And so I gave up guest services, and when the property was purchased um, by Mace Ridge, um, the young lady that was here before doing marketing, she decided to stay with Simon, and she went to Port Charlotte, and I decided to stay here with Lake Square. And okay. so, which came in Ridge, and so I became the marketing manager there. Manager. Yeah, okay. so, yep. So your mission for the mall in the next couple of years, you have a five-year plan, I guess. Or yeah, I, I think we do. We, we want it to, to realize that, you know what, it's, yes, it's going to take time. You know, Rome wasn't built in a day, they, they mm -hmm. say. And so we are bringing in the stores. They are starting to contact us. Um, you know, what we want people to know is that and realize is that 
people, the stores won't come unless the people come. Right. You know, because the stores won't come until they see that foot traffic. So that's why we built the entertainment. Because when V Entertainment came in, it brought in the people. We start doing these different programs for the people, whether it's Zumba classes, yoga, like we were talking about before. You know what? That's bringing in the foot traffic. We have a new store in Malise that went in. It's a clothing store, beautiful mm -hmm. store. And so once we can get, they, they start seeing that, which they have now, right. now they're contacting us and they want to come in. We have a Starbucks going to be opening. Um, okay. So we bought a franchise of that. Um, AMC is doing about a $6 million renovation. Um, they're going to actually take their theaters, some of them, and divide, like take down the wall and make them bigger. Um, right. They're going to be stadium seating. seating. They're going to sell beer, wine, liquor, wow. yeah, food. So you know, so, so you it's, don't need the police eventually. That, yeah, you know. Well, I'm hoping not, but you know. So, but you never know. But no, we're you know, so we're kind of looking to revitalize it, and I think okay. it's it's happening. You know, the new owners that came in, they decided they came in and. They had the, the funds to do it, they had the, the love to do it, and they, I mean, their properties back up where they're from in Istanbul are just out of this world, and so. So, so let me ask you this, on another note, mm -hmm. I gather you're enjoying your job. I love my job. Okay, and your mission for the next five years is y'all just going to grow pretty much. Yes, correct? we're looking to extremely okay, so the other question I've got to ask you, your outdoor shows, how many do you intend to have them per year? We have RV shows basically monthly. Um, so yes. Twelve. Yes. Okay. Yeah, we have them basically monthly. We do have carnivals. Um, mm -hmm. We sh we we do have a carnival this Saturday, of course, for V Entertainment's annual fest, VFS. But we will have another carnival. We normally do. Okay. We just had a petting zoo um, that was just at V Entertainment. Um, you know, we're looking to do host a home improvement show in April. Um, that'll be throughout the whole mall. Um, Breast Cancer Month, of course, we'll do another show for breast cancer and bring that back because it kind of. It, it, we didn't have it when we became Mace Rich. We stopped. Okay. And so, and another thing I think we'd like to bring back is, and as I thought about it more, is back in the day we held um, Back to School Fair. And it was okay. the biggest Lake County Lake Back to School Fair we ever had. And people looked forward to it. And when Mace Rich took over, we just, we didn't have it at that time. And so now I think we're going to try to bring that back. Okay. And so who you have mainly working with you? Um, I have my assistant, Kara, who's okay. here, yeah, Kara McKinney, and she has been here with me now for a few months. She's new to this, but she's doing real well, so. So she know. loves promotions and yeah, marketing definitely. and everything? Yeah, definitely. Okay. And on your aspect, what is your background? Um, I actually went to school for accounting. <laughs> accounting? Yeah, I know, and uh, didn't care for that too much, you know, and my born and raised back home in New York, and mm -hmm. so, but I just wasn't my deal and when I came here it kind of opened up a vast array of different opportunities and when I started working with one of our old marketing directors I just kind of fell right into right it. Right yep. okay. Well for more information you can go down below and then mm -hmm. do you have any words you need to say to them? No, just we want you to come out and enjoy what we're doing here you know we want to see you guys enjoy what we're having and come out because it'll help us out join us Saturday at VFS Florida our annual event from 10 to 9 at V Entertainment in the parking lot. Thank you.